Hello and welcome back to the craft box. My name is Brent and today we're on episode 272 of the Wizard 101 Death Walkthrough. I love it when anything ends in two, it rhymes. It's so good. Um, but yes, we are on episode 272. Amazing. Last time, if you haven't checked it out already, we um, defeated Helena. Um, and uh, yeah, she was pretty easy, not gonna lie. She wasn't even a boss, so she's bad. And today we're heading into here to save Spark. Is the dialogue gonna load? I, I'm pretty sure it's on. I Yeah, it is on. We just need to wait for Lord it to load. Lord Banatus warned us subversives might try to sneak into the city through one of these docks. We are not subversives. I am Lady Helena Verga, once Praetor of the Justicaria. And this is the wizard. They're not bad. Impossible! She fell to her own husband's treason. Whoever you really are, you'll go no further. Wizard, watch out. I saw some Nimbari guards head your way. <sighs> Thanks, pig. Yep, good job. Good job. Good job, Pork. You did well. Um, I need to quickly change up this. But anyway, I will be back once we have defeated these guys because they're not too difficult at all. If we keep to these courtyards, they'll loop us around the spire and into the citadel. Careful. Someone must have heard that fight. Elite forces are moving to intercept you. Okay. I am back. Hi. Um, elite forces are moving to intercept me, apparently. Who would have guessed that? Not me! You're the subversive? Vanitas is the subversive. Your orders are subversive. Vanitas is in league with non-Empyrean agents, trafficking in our fears and technology. And your proof? I see you have none. Then I'm sorry. We fought together, wizard. We captured the bat. But you do travel with traitor Karis' son. You wield the forbidden magic. And I have my orders. Yep, I wield the forbidden magic, definitely. Always and also why are you death. This is traitorous. You're a traitor and I do not approve of it But I will be back in just a bit once I've defeated these guys. Okay. I am back. We are killing now Hopefully we boost on both of them so good. Um, but anyway, that definitely killed so GG is a clap boys um, Really really easy. You can't win wizard the Praetor's up ahead with a platoon of exemplars. Just surrender Nimbari don't surrender Captain, you forget, as I had forgotten, we are the light that pierces the darkness. But it can be drowned. Quickly, wizard, the exit to the citadel is just down here. Uh, guys, I think they're on to us. Okie dokie, he thinks they're on to us, which is not good. Um, I believe the proctor is next, or the... the practor? What are you waiting for, Praetor? Destroy them! Ma'am, you can't. As I said, that is Lady Helena Verga, alive and well. She saved me from the ambush he arranged. I know who she is, but orders are orders, Justicar. But who gives those orders? Not the Vice Reign. She stays conspicuously silent. Has she nothing to say? Yes! What does the Vice Reign say? She... she says, destroy them. The wizard, the pig. The outcast and the dissident Justicar. Destroy them all. No! She speaks with the serpent's tongue. Can you not all see this is wrong? I will not take arms against a traitor at his behest. Who's with me? Traitors! Deserters! Will none of you keep your oaths? Fine. I will deal with this myself. Okie dokie, I need to quickly check up the cheats, um, really, really quickly there. Um, defeat her, and she is myth, which is exciting. She has no cheats, she does have shadow pips, she boosts a storm, she is stunnable, she is beguilable, and not that we use any of that. I'm quite happy that they started adding, like, beguilable people in. Um, it's really good. Also, there is no minions, so that's always a good thing. Uh, we will add a faint or two, and probably a potent as well. Um, and we can probably just go for a Kizma or a, another, uh, a, 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 a what's it face? What's her face? What's its face? Yeah. Hmm. Um, yeah, Kizma's probably the best option here. <laughs> as soon as we can hit, which will be in like three rounds, probably. So yeah, that'll be easy clap. Um, but yeah, she is not that difficult, like 11k health, I think. Ah, uh, yeah, 11k, not too bad. Oh, wow, an earthquake. Wow, so good. Uh, you think you're good, bruh? 
You think he a good brah? Not that I care, did no damage and only took one blade, so the joke is on you. You are bad. BAD bad. Sorry, you are bad. Not good, bad. Very bad. Very, very bad. No, bad, bad. Um, but yeah, faint. We'll just go with faints if you're gonna earthquake me. Sure, if you want that more. I mean, nothing against me. I mean, I'm not the one causing these difficulties in our relationship. You're the one being hostile and causing friction between us. I just wanted to destroy you. Easy peasy, I was just gonna blade, but now you've made me faint. Like, how do you think you feel? Also, this is gonna be a... Not a snake charmer. Next round will be a mystic, because that's what she can do. Um, so in order to prevent that, or circumvent that, we are going to go for a one of these. A kisma. Might kill, who knows. It, it will do a lot, if not, and we can always follow up with um, something, who knows. Um, like a blade or something, because that's uh, that can kill. Definitely, just a blade on itself can kill. 100% confirmed, crit. Oh, oh yes. No block. Oh, you blocked. Wow, you're bad. She's actually good. She can block. I can't block, you see. I'm kind of jealous. When people can block and I can't, it's, like, really embarrassing. That was my phone. Just ignore it. Um, just pretend it never, never sounded. Um, okay. Wow, we are just getting these shadow pips. Like, a no, no, no end of shadow pips. We are gonna just hit with a Lulu because we can kill. I'm 90% sure we can kill. And, I mean, with Myth, you kind of have to qu kill quick, otherwise you're dead. Um, especially when they have Shadow Pips. <laughs> that is the scariest part of Myth. Them having Shadow Pips. I'm assuming this does, like, yeah, that should have killed. Right. I don't think she had any more than 3k. Or 2.5. Yep, GG. You chose the wrong side, Drusilla. I sincerely hope you're right. I'll take command of things out here, my lady. You three get to the Citadel proper, and into the Spire. Well, that was really easy. I'm surprised. Well, let's head over to the Citadel proper and into the Spire. And we will see what we have to do next. I was going to say finish the episode, but oh, we've only just started. Oh, if only you know, and we've only just started. Um, Giles is still here. Nice dude. Now at last, I will be reunited with my son. The balcony Vanita spoke from connects to his private wing in the Spire. No doubt that is where he has sparked. Pig, you stand guard out here. Shouldn't I come with you? Do we even know what kind of defenses are waiting inside? The automated kind. Justicars aren't permitted in the private wings, so dwarven robots are used for security. Nothing we can't handle. Okay then, I'll use my undeniable charms to win any remaining hostile Justicars to our side. Good luck. If that's your plan, you'll need it more than we will. Come on, wizard. Okay, let's hit on in. Oh, that XP though. Oh my gosh, so good. Also, what does she give us? I don't think we looked at this last time. Um, uh, I'm assuming it'll be something stupid like, um, not pierce, um, uh, not block, not crit, probably not crit at all. Um, probably like power pip. Yeah, if it's power pip, three percent power pip. Why? Why do they give us power pip? It just doesn't, to me, it just doesn't make sense. Like, I just don't understand why. Like, it, it's just kind of ridiculous in my opinion. But anyway, that's how it works. Ho <laughs> ho, another instance. And I think that'll probably be the end of the episode once we've done this one. Oh my gosh, she's... Oof. Oof. Load, please. Why don't Paul, they load this? You do not have permission to approach the vice rain. Submit yourself for merciful execution. <laughs> robots. Yeah, robots. I will be back once I've defeated the <laughs> robots. Okay, I am back. We are just about to kill. Um, with this dot, I did easy clap. Um, Hello again, vice rain. I haven't seen you since you proclaimed my husband a traitor, then bent the knee to that snake, Vanitas. We bow to no one, Helena, but look what's happened. Myth monsters, Xanadu, the Dark Cloud, the Athenor Chain, the prophesized war has come! So you had Vanitas build a storm cannon to win it for you? More than that, he converted the entire citadel into a cannon. It uses the turbine mirrors to aim and fire a beam of raw energy. But that kind of power could drill a hole through a mountain. That's madness. That's security. Necessary security in these dark days. 
so we gave Vanitas anything he asked. But perhaps we let our fear drive us too far. I never knew she was so weak-hearted. Come, wizard, let's find Vanitas before his vile plan comes to fruition. Helena is one, one girl I can get behind. She is strong and independent. I like it. I like it. Lord Vanitas, I did not help you construct a new spiral arc to store your artwork. We're supposed to be preparing for a potential evacuation. Oh, shut up, boy. I'm busy here. Blasted robot, hurry up and pack my Penguin Elisa. They'll be here soon. Don't you dare tell my son to shut up, creature. Your son? Mother? Fascinating. <laughs> no! How many diversions must I throw in your path? Robots, deal with these intruders. Um, again, I will be back once I've um, defeated these bad bots. Not bad bots, bad bots with the with the D. Yeah, you, you got that? Okay, good. Okay, I'm back. Hopefully this should kill. Um, one Lulu did not kill, so maybe another one? Possibly? Bye bye. Yep, definitely. Probably, most likely. Um, yeah, yeah. Right, good, it killed. Yep, GG. Yep, GG. Cool. Spark, you must believe me. I am your mother. Much of what you've been told is a lie. I was not lost, and your father was never a traitor. But Vanitas is. Yes, I know. He was altogether too genial to me relative to other Nimbari. So naturally, I suspected treachery. That's my boy. But why was he so interested in you in the first place? He casually cast our family aside years ago. Because I finished the spiral arc. The ship intended to shield the Cabal from the end of the spiral. He had me complete another. It is moored atop this very tower now. But, given my aforementioned suspicions of Vanitas's treachery, I felt it prudent to sabotage the vessel. So Vanitas is trapped atop this tower like the rat he is? You've done well, son. Join Cork outside. Wizard, let's finish this. Like I said, I love, I love Helena so or Helena. I don't know. I can't remember what it is. If it's Helena or Helena. No, Helen. no, no. This is not how things are going to end. Not after all this time. All this work. Before I vent years of repressed frustration, I need to know why. Why betray your friends, your people, the cause of Grandmother Raven herself? Because she lied to us, threw us in a prison, and called it a mission. She robbed us of the spiral by burying us in the ether. Do you even know what that is? It's not a shield, not a light to be worshipped. It's rage. The metaphysical remnant of Raven's war with Spider. She buried us in the ashes of a dead quarrel. So when the Cabal offered the chance to rebuild the world lost in that war, how could I refuse? Alas, they too put their faith in a divinity. They believe Spider will restore the first world. I'm not so trusting. Hence my new Spiral Arc. Maybe Spider keeps to his word and restores the first world, but if he doesn't, I'll be safe in this ship. Either way, I win. You lose. Is it really what you think it is? Um, so yeah, he cheats, obviously, because he's kind of like a big deal. Um, if you join late, he'll cast a star version of Beguile that lasts, um, three rounds. Um, servants, he will shout, and starting on round two, he'll cast a star spell, which summons Justicon Storms. Um, uh, Justicons defend me. If attacked, he will cast a star spell to remove one, remove all health on one of his minions. I surrender, starting on round two. If the boss is attacked without any minions present, he flees the joke. So that's hopefully what I'm trying to do. I mean... I mean, I, I tried to do that. Apparently it didn't work very well. Um kind of confused at how, how that worked, but maybe, oh, starting on round two, so this round here, um, this mean this means that he will flee, right? Because they're not in the jewel, right? Yeah, I surrender. Easy clap, boys. GG! The, the easiest fight to win, we just need to defeat this guy, which, um, we have so many wanteds, I thought, I thought wanteds would help, because I didn't read the round two bit, 
But um, it's fine. It's whatever. I don't really care. We can easily kill these guys. Uh, but yeah, he's gone. Um, not very difficult him as a boss. Um, really, really simple. As long as you have a thing to get. I mean, a thing. A thing. Yeah, that, that would just leave it at that. A thing. As long as you have a hit on round two. Easy clap. Um, we're going to enchant the Kizma. We're just going to keep wand hitting until we get a, until we get a Shadow Pip. And hopefully things will be good. Basically, this is our strategy now. Um, it's really fun. But I mean, eventually it will take. Oh, look, there's a Shadow Pip. Wow, what a surprise. Confirm. There we go. GG, hopefully. Actually, no, this guy has probably a bit of health. I don't know. I don't know how much this does. I don't use this without blades much. I, I barely use Kizma because... I mainly use Lulu because there's a lot of people, generally. Um, and if I'm killing just a boss, generally would have blades. But, you know, it's just a minion. It'll be fine. Yep, easy. Wow, that does a lot. Jeez. Holy moly. It's over, worm. You can't escape. Your ship doesn't even fly. Now, tell us why you and the Admiral converted the Citadel into a storm cannon. Heard about that, huh? That little earmark kept me in contracts and riches for years. I suppose I should be happy someone found a use for it. And such a devious use. The Admiral may be mad, foul, and likely not even a real Admiral, but he's made a clever friend. Enough fawning! What is he planning to do with the Storm Cannon? He's going to free the Chaos Heart and return it to Grandfather Spider. Then you're going to give us access to the control room so we can stop him. Wizard, find Spark and Pork and meet me there. Okay, we're going to talk to Spark and Pork and then we're going to end off. Because this is getting some serious and I need to already, like, just just have a wee little moment to, like, digest what's happening. Oh, Wizard, there you are. Helena's making Thanatus open the way to the main Storm Cannon control room. Spark, meanwhile, has been explaining why he left me at the mercy of the villainous Cabal. As I said, I was confident in the wizard's proficiency, and it was more strategically sound for me to monitor Vanitas's dubious intentions. Enough of your fancy Nimbari verbiage, Spark. <laughs> I was only joking. You did well, but now the wizard needs your help. Go with him and use your technical expertise to disable the Admiral's storm cannon. I'll stay here to help Helena keep an eye on Vanitas. If you say so, Captain. Wizard, it looks as though my mother has opened the way for us. I'll follow your lead. Okay. Whew. Lots of XP. So much XP. Um, hmm, do we want to talk? Uh, we'll talk. Good timing, Wizard. This slug was about to tell me how the Admiral intends to free the Chaos Heart from its indestructible paradox chains. Indestructible, save the touch of the Raven Child, or her luminiferous essence. But we had neither, so Spider gave the Admiral a new plan. Spider can't break the chains, but they're moored to places our cannon can destroy. Blow up the Temples of Light, the heart falls free. That's the plan? Scare the Vicerine into building this cannon, then destroy Numaya and its Temple of Light to sever our chain of myth and storm? You see why I was eager to leave. That is a truly illogical plan, bordering on mental instability. Wizard, <laughs> we must stop the Admiral at once, or everything is lost. Yeah, and, and now we know why he wanted to leave, and next episode we will see if we can stop this diabolically illogical and bordering on mentally unstable plan um but anyway thank you for watching room to like and subscribe if you're already subscribed press the wee little bell so you know exactly when i post another video and remember craft outside the box